Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new, welcome. Today I'll be doing my first Get Ready With Me video on my channel, and this look is a summer inspired look. It's super simple and super affordable, so let's just get started. So before I start my makeup, I'm going to be using this dual action moisturizer from Clean and Clear, and I'm going to be using this Wet n Wild Coverall Primer as a base for my face to make it all nice and pretty. So starting with my brows, I'm going to be using this NYX Control Freak Eyebrow Gel. I just got this the other day and I'm really satisfied with it. Look how it is just taming the brows, guys. It just really works really nice. It's a good base to start on your brows before you start filling them in and shaping them and all that good stuff. Next, I'm going to be filling in and shaping my brows with my Beauty Bakery brow knee dip. I really love this brow dip. It just works so well with my eyebrows and it matches perfectly. Like, it's just a maze. So yeah, um, I just want to get my brows all nice and fleeky. After I'm done with that, I'm going to conceal the brow with my NYX um, Correct and Correct. Gosh, I can never say this. Correct Conceal and Contour Palette in the color medium. And as you guys saw in my recent video, I pretty much do the same exact thing. Just going to conceal it, make it look all clean and nice and shaped. I haven't done my eyebrows in about a month or two, actually. So these are raw untamed brows. That's why I need to conceal them. <laughs> so unfortunately I thought I was recording when I put my foundation on but I was not. So anyway I was using I used today for my foundation my Tarte foundation in the color Tan Honey and my Pro Conceal Concealer from LA Girl in the color Fawn mixed together and put my foundation on. Then I went in with my Corrector Palette from NYX and highlight under my eyes, my nose, my chin, my cupid's bow, and my forehead. <laughs> So I got this new HD finishing powder from NYX in the color Banana and I have to say I'm in love with it. I really really like it. It works really great and I'm going to just set my highlight with this HD powder. So next, I'm going to be contouring my face with my NYX Pro Highlight and Contour Palette and using that color there to contour my cheekbones, my forehead. You guys know the deal, how I do, or whatever. Using that same color from my NYX Contour and Highlight Palette, I'm going to use this petite contour brush from Equal Tools and contour my nose. Using 
Using my buffing brush from Real Techniques, I'm going to buff out all those harsh lines. So, moving on to my bronzers, I'm using this All Over Glow from Ruby Kisses. I can't remember the exact name right now, but I will definitely put it in the description below. And I'm going to use this big fluffy brush just to give myself a glow. Yes, glow. We're going to glow up, guys. Glow up. Glow up 2015. Yes, turn up. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Next, I'll be using my favorite e.l.f. golden bronzer, and I'll be using this color here to highlight my cheeks. I love this golden bronzer so, so much, and it was only $3, like I've said before. Let me know in the comments below if you guys have tried it or have it, and how do you like it? Because I love it, love it, love it, love it. Next, I'll be using this highlighter from my NYX Highlight and Contour Palette and going over my golden bronzer. And as you guys can see, it just like illuminates the face, like makes it all nice and pretty. And I'm gonna use it on my nose, my Cupid's bow, and I believe I used it on my chin too. Moving on, this blush I got from Forever 21. They're from their Love and Beauty line, and I love it. Look at that pink, guys, look at that pink. I am just in love. And I'm going to be using it on my cheeks today. And yeah, just buffing that in. It just, oh, that color is so amazing. As if it wasn't pink enough, I'm going to go over it with this pink fake blush that I got from Forever 21 on as well. And like I said before, it's kind of like a sheer, but it is buildable. And yeah, I just love it. So I'm going to use this fluffy brush and then blend them together and buff them out so it won't be too harsh and I won't look like a clown or anything like that because that's not good. You know, that won't be good. Moving on to my eyeshadow, I'm going to be using this color from my natural palette from Forever 21. And I'm going to be using this angled eyeshadow brush and just placing that color into my crease of my eye. Next, I'll be using this gold color from my palette and placing it on my lid and blending it in with the brown that I've already used. I'm going to go in with the very first blush that I used on my cheeks and blend it in with the gold color that I have placed on my eye just to give it a little pop of color and so it can match with the blush that I already have on my cheeks. For my box beauty from Motives, I'm going to use this color in the palette and go over the gold area that I have placed on my lid, but kind of blending it in with that light pink color as well and just bringing it all the way over to my tear duct of my eye. Mm -hmm. 
And going over to my e.l.f. golden bronzer, I'm using this color here to highlight the tear ducts of my eye. I'll be using my NYX gel liner to do my cat eye that you guys know I have a little hard time doing, but I love this brush. I got it from Essential Tools at Walmart for $5. It actually came in a pack with uh, two other brushes, but yeah, it was super cheap and I love using it. It works so good. Yeah. <laughs> Next, I'll be going in with my Ardell Demi Wispies. I love these lashes, um, but for some reason, I didn't film me, me film, blah, 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 film me, put, film, blah, 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 film myself putting them on. Why can't I talk today? Anyway, yeah, thought I was filming, but it wasn't, and I'm just so sorry, but I will definitely um, try better next time. <laughs> I love these lashes, though. They're amazing, and they make your eyes look so cute and sassy. I don't know. I just like using that word sassy. Sass. A little bit of sass. Moving on to my lips, I'm going to be creating kind of a pinkish ombre color. And I'm going to first line my lips with this color from NYX. Their lip liners are amazing and it's in the color Fuchsia. I love Love their lip liners. They work really, really great and they're inexpensive. You can find them at Target, Ulta, or I believe CVS as well. Next, I'll be using this liquid lipstick from Beauty Bakery in the color Electric Pink. It's not on the website yet, but it will be out soon. And I really love this color. It's super vibrant, super pink, and it just reminds me of summer. And the last step to finish this ombre look, I'm going to be using another product from Beauty Bakery. It is their Cake Pop Lippy in the color Birthday Cake. And I really like this color. It's so cute and pink. And I'm going to put it in the center of my lips. And to finish up this look, I'm going to just set my makeup with the Infallible Pro Set Spray from L'Oreal. Yeah, fan, fan, fan. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a comment down below what you liked about it and give me some suggestions on what you guys want to see next. Don't forget to like this video as well and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!